What's up, everybody? It's me, your boy, the Fluffy Gamer. How you guys doing today? Today is Saturday, February the 11th. I went out and did some more thrifting, some more hunting, found some more stuff. Starting off down in the Chula Vista area, slowly making my way back up to, like, downtown San Diego area, middle area of San Diego. But anyways, let's start off with the first stop of the day, which was the Desert Thrift Store in Chula Vista. Found some stuff, starting with a Disney film, The Wonderful World of Disney. This is from the uh, Disney Movie Club exclusive. Had a feeling... Might be out of print from a movie club, and it is in a movie called Polly. Never seen or heard of this Disney film before, but I do recognize this lady. I believe that is Miss Huxtables, Miss Hux Huxtable from the uh, Cosby Kids. Pretty sure that's her. Pretty sure it's her. Movie called Polly. No insert. This is in great shape though. Two bucks. Desert thrift store. Some some DVDs are two, some are three. Beautiful shape. Beautiful shape. Going up in the bay. This goes for 20 bucks. Alright. Next thing I found over at the Desert Thrift Store is another DVD. This I believe it's like a documentary. The story of Top Gun, the true story of the Elite Fighter Pilot School. On DVD, two bucks. Pretty sure, probably all around the San Diego area. That's probably why I ended up at a thrift store. No insert if there was any or not. Great shape. Should be able to get like 10 to 12 bucks. The story of Top Gun. Going up on the bay. All right, and then these, I'm going to lot these ones. This is, a, this is a TV series. These are both friend, uh, friend. These are both brand new factory seal seasons four and five of Walker, Texas Ranger. I guess there's like a new one. They did like a reboot with a new guy playing him. But uh, good old Chuck Norris right here, Walker, Texas Ranger. Season four, brand new factory seal going up on the bay. Season four. I don't know why they got the, uh, there's a sticker over Covering the EPC code for some reason. But that's season four. And then we got season five. The fifth season of Walker, Texas Ranger. Brand new. Factor seal. These were four bucks each. So eight dollars. Probably get right around 15 each. I'm probably going to lot it. 30 bucks plus shipping. I see people lot it. And they seem to sell a lot easier. Maybe get a little more money. Not sure. But going to lot it. Season four and five. Going up on the bay. All right. That's all I got over at the Desert Thrift Store. Next place that I went to was the uh, Veterans Struck Out. Went a little further down to the Big Ass Goodwill. Only found one thing inside there. Blu-ray, DVD, brand new factory seal with the slip cover. I've not seen this one before. I like the first one. This is the sequel. And that is Disney Pixar Incredibles 2. Remember enjoying the first one. Remember seeing that one in the theater. But this one, part two. I have not seen. This is a uh, brand new factory sealed with the slip cover. Should be able to get right around 12 bucks plus shipping. Pay $3.99. I got no discount because I only found one thing. Oh, wait, you know what? I take that back. I don't know if she thought it was a DVD or not, but she only charged me $2.99. I only paid $2.99. I was not going to complain. <laughs> not going to complain. So two ninety three bucks. Blu-ray plus DVD, brand new factory sale with the slip cover going up on the bay. Um, that's all I got at the big ass Goodwill. Then I went a little further down to the Salvation Army. Struck out. Went to my honey hole. Somewhere around there. In San Diego. Another Goodwill. And I found a bunch more stuff over there. A bunch of stuff. Still in the bag. What did I pay? how much I paid paid $17 it was like $16.95 I rounded it up to $17 I, spent, uh, I, I donated the extra nickel to the Goodwill Foundation let's see what I got let's see what I got in this baggie right here start it with another TV series another TV series 
These are both brand new factories. So probably going to lot these too. I wouldn't say probably like 10 to 15 bucks, somewhere around there. And that is the complete fifth season of... I never got into this series for some reason. I, I've seen some episodes. They are kind of funny. I guess the later series, they got really funny because they were like... like, like pop culture related like uh recent stuff that's going on in the in the world so i guess i guess it got a lot more popular with what men them making fun of what's going on in the world but that is south park and this is the complete fifth season right here brand new factory sealed and marked for 3.99 goodwill 3.99 brand new best buy it was 30 bucks 30 bucks best buy going up on the bay going up on the bay and here it is, uh, the the sixth season, season six, also three ninety nine. This one was thirty nine ninety nine at Best Buy, at Best Buy, right here. Going up on the bay. Probably gonna lot those two as well, just like the Walker Texas Ranger. Uh, what else did I get in the bag? What else is in the bag? I found these one before, worth at least about right around ten bucks plus shipping. Another Walt Disney film called Polly Anna, older Disney film, Polly Anna. Going up on the bay. I don't know if there's a chapter insert or not, but there is like a not a chapter insert, but there's some advertisement. To this set, discs are in great shape. Going up on the bay. Going up on the bay. Love Disney. All right. What else did I get over at the honey hole? Oh, okay. Two more things from the honey hole. Another TV series from... The BBC. I was hoping these would be worth a little bit more. But the Blu-rays. If you find the Blu-rays, grab those. I saw these. These are the DVD versions. And they're brand new sealed. So I was like, hmm, might be worth a little something. There's definitely a little meat on the bones. These ones I'm probably going to lot together as well. And that is, like I said, BBC. The British Broadcast Corporation show. Red Dwarf. The, the original series. This is series one. Series one, brand new factory sealed. Paid three dollars. I might be able to get maybe ten bucks, maybe, hopefully. Same thing with this one. This was a uh, Red Dwarf two, the original series, Red Dwarf two. Brand new factory sealed. Again, hopefully, hopefully, ten bucks. Probably gonna lot those as one. I think I've seen other others sold for uh, the uh, series one and two. So, but anyways, that is everything that I got at the Honey Hole. Seventeen bucks for all that, and then uh, the last place that I went to was another local Goodwill. This one was in downtown La Mesa, downtown La Mesa, and I picked up four items. One is a video game, a Wii U. I think this used to go for a little bit more at one point, but it doesn't seem to go for much. But um, these this should have been $3.99, I believe, or maybe even $4.99 for the games. But for whatever reason, I, I think maybe the lady thought it was a movie. I'm not going to complain. Not going to complain. And that is the Wii U game of... It's got all these different characters. Nintendo Land. This is complete... Got the video game. Disc is in beautiful shape. Beautiful shape. And it has some advertisement. Some advertisements. What is that? Super Mario Brothers U. And another advertisement. Another advertisement. Along with, this seems to be in very good condition. What just fell? Oh, okay. All right. And the manual. Manual seems to be in good shape. Very good shape. Yeah. Never had never never had a play to Wii U before. Never had one. I have a Wii. Didn't really play that much, but I played a little bit of it. But yeah, should be able to get about 12 bucks plus shipping. This is definitely going up on the bay. Case is in good shape. There's a couple like you know imperfections on the plastic. But other than that, pretty good shape. Disc is great shape. Uh, let's see. The next thing we uh, picked up was a brand new sealed copy of a very funny movie from the 80s. Remember, remember liking this. This was pretty funny. Kind of dark humor. 
And then, uh, yeah, starring John Belushi and Dan Aykroyd. Very young in this movie, early 80s. And uh, <laughs> I just noticed a sticker on there. Uh, but yeah, this, this movie is called Neighbors. It's a comic nightmare. Dan Aykroyd and John Belushi. Dan Aykroyd's in the window with his girlfriend. Trying to bother the neighbors. They're like so cool in this movie. Uh, this is brand new sealed. And I just noticed there's a sticker on the back, $3.99. I just, I saw the side and then I saw the front and saw it was sealed. I was like, you know what? I'm getting it. I did not see that sticker on there. She did not see it either late at the counter. So $2.99 going up on the bay. I, it's not worth much. Maybe 10 bucks plus shipping. I, I think I have this already. If I don't, I'm going to keep this one. So going up on the bay. Uh, next thing I picked up is a TV show. Also brand new factor seal. This is a Emmy Award winning drama series. And this is the very first season of The Handmaid's Tale. On DVD. Handmaid's Tale right here. Going up on the bay. Brand new. Winner of eight Emmy Awards. Outstanding drama series. Outstanding lead actress drama series. All right. Handmaid's Tale. Never seen an episode. Don't know what it's about. And then the last thing that I found for today at the local Goodwill, the last and final Goodwill, is another brand new sealed copy. I also paid $2.99. I find these all the time. They work, they go for some good money, even, even used, usually around $10. Bucks. It's in good shape. This is brand new sealed, so I should be able to get right around $20 bucks plus shipping for a Sullivan Entertainment movie called Anne of Green Gables, the continuing story. They made they made several of these. I don't know if the, uh, I've seen two other ones. So this is like the third different one that I've come across. They're all worth some money. They're all worth some money. I've not come across this one yet. So as far as I know, there's at least three different uh, movies of Anne of Green Gables. So if you see these, they all all the covers look the same. They got like the yellow around the bottom top. It's always a chick. It's always a chick right there. But yeah, going up on the base, you better get 20 bucks. This looks like a Canada release. See in the Canada, Canada loco, but it's okay. It's region one for US and Canada. So that's gonna do it. That's all I got for today on Saturday. Not too bad. Not too bad. That's gonna do it. See you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.